achieving an elegant and classy look doesn't always have to be expensive. In fact, many times the most stylish outfits are those that you can mix and match from your wardrobe or find inexpensively at a thrift store. In order to look stylish, you must first be confident in yourself, because style starts from within. To help you get started with dressing well on any budget, today I am going to show you fashion tips for every season, men and women. Before the start of the video, make sure to leave a like, and if you want to see more content, subscribe to the channel. Let's get started. How to dress classy for any occasion. Everyone has their own definition of what it means to dress classy. But first and foremost, dressing well should be about being comfortable in your clothes. Dressing for a formal occasion doesn't mean you have to wear a tuxedo or ball gown. There are plenty of great outfits that will work for any event. How to look expensive. Buy clothes in your actual size rather than one smaller. When items are too small, they will never look as good on you. Wear clothes that fit correctly so they don't restrict movement. Don't just look at how something fits your body, though. Also consider if it flatters your figure. The higher waistline on a pencil skirt can give an hourglass shape, while certain men's shirt collars can help to balance a round face. Buy quality over quantity. Cheap clothes look bad after some time because they fade in color and lose shape quickly, which means that people need to spend more money to purchase new clothing items. Invest in classic pieces that you know will last for many years. Some examples might be black pumps, dark wash jeans, or a fitted peplum top. It's also important to remember that classics don't always mean boring. Mix prints to add interest without being too loud. You might not think of combining printed pants with a lace top, but it's worth trying new things to develop your personal style. Make sure to take care of your clothes by washing them on the gentle cycle and hanging them up to dry. This will prevent wrinkles and keep colors bright. Dry clean suits or dresses that are made out of fabric like silk or lace, even if they're machine washable. Invest in good quality, non-slip clothes hangers and consider buying a clothes steamer which is gentler for clothes than ironing. Don't get too attached to one particular style. Always remember that trends come and go, so if there's a trend or look that you're really into right now, chances are it will be over in six months. Instead of buying things just because they're trendy, try and find things that you like the look of, even if it's not in style at the moment. Mix and match your favorite pieces to create different looks that you can wear on a daily basis. Just because something is labeled for nighttime doesn't mean it can't be worn in the daytime or vice versa. For example, try wearing black dress pants with heels during the daytime over a pair of nice jeans and a blouse. Don't wait until you have a specific event to go shopping for it. Even if you don't need anything at the moment, planning ahead will ensure that when something does come up, there are pieces already in your wardrobe that match. This way, all you'll have to do is grab those items and wear them, rather than having to go purchase something you don't actually need yet. Look at yourself from different angles. Try standing up and looking in a full-length mirror. Don't just stand with one leg in front of the other, stand normally. Don't be afraid to mix high-end with low-end. If your money is tight or you can only buy a few things this season, don't worry about the brands because nobody will know. Find out what colors work best for your skin tone. Favor neutral colors and styles don't be afraid to try new things. Be open-minded about how you can style an item differently than the way it's shown in its original packaging or on a mannequin in the store. Sometimes just changing up how you wear something is an easy way to breathe life into your wardrobe and make an old piece feel new again. How do I know when to dress casual or formal? Dressing for a particular occasion is all about paying attention to the details and dressing to suit your body shape. If you are going for a job interview, it is best to be overdressed rather than underdressed. For an important meeting, be sure to dress formally. But if you are attending a less formal industry event like a networking session or conference, then the dress code might be more casual. If an event is described as business casual, it means that men should wear pants and women may either choose to wear slacks or dresses or skirts. For a casual dinner date or social event, choose an outfit that makes you feel confident and comfortable. You can also opt for jeans if they fit well. When in doubt about the right dress code, it is always better to dress too formally rather than not formally enough. A navy blue blazer is versatile for both men and women. You can dress it up or down for a formal or casual look. For any event, if you want to look stylish, then the easiest way is to wear a pair of statement shoes or a standout accessory, like a silk tie for men or a luxury handbag for women. How to dress classy for men. For men, get started by investing in quality pieces that will last. 
It's better if they're versatile enough to wear to different occasions, so consider investing in a suit or dress pants and button-down shirt. Make sure the clothes fit well by having them tailored if necessary. It will be worth it in the long run. In addition to quality over quantity, when shopping for men's suits, look for timeless pieces with interesting textures and patterns that will help you stand out without being too loud or distracting. A tailored wool blazer is never out of style and can go well with any outfit. For a truly customized look, consider having a bespoke garment made for you. When going for an interview or attending any formal event, men should wear dressy shoes with leather uppers, not sneakers. For formal events such as black tie parties, tuxedos are the most appropriate choice for men. Men can also wear a suit without a tie, but they need to make sure that it looks slightly dressier by adding accessories such as cufflinks or a pocket square in their blazer pockets. For less formal events and occasions, men can wear semi-casual outfits like jeans with a blazer or a button-up shirt. How to dress classy for women For women, a good tip is to find inexpensive items at thrift stores and mix them with high-quality pieces you already invested in, so they can last long-term. This way, not only are your outfits on point, but they're reasonably priced, too. Luxurious fabrics like cashmere and silk will never go out of style. An oversized cashmere coat like this one from Gentle Herd looks effortlessly chic. Channel your inner Audrey Hepburn in an LBD, little black dress, with a pearl necklace and red lip. Make sure that your underwear is giving support. If it isn't fitting properly, then all of the other things in your outfit won't fit right either. Think of accessories as the icing on top of the cake. Make sure everything works together to give an overall cohesive look and classy vibe. For example, if you wear statement earrings, then keep everything else simple. While shopping online can be helpful for finding things within budget or in your size, take note of reviews and ask other people who have tried the product before. If the majority of people say that it runs small or large, then take note and order accordingly. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications to see more of our future videos. With that said, keep enjoying our videos, and I'll see you in the next video.